Because they're cool souvenirs, but because I realized something special. Uh, that little black magnetic strip there, it doesn't just record how long your stay is at a hotel. It actually has your hotel address, has your home address, has your visa card number, it even has the license of the car if you valet it with the hotel. All of that stays encrypted on the back of this card forever until they recode over top of it. A lot of hotels don't recode over top of them, and so a criminal can actually steal the information. I realized, though, that if the black strip were a little bit longer, if it were longer, I could actually extend my stay because the length of the black magnetic strip would be longer, so I can actually make my card just a little bit longer, which then makes my stay a lot longer. K kind of weird, huh? I, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking that's a pretty looking weird card because it's in between and it's large, but if I just kind of squeeze like this lightly, it'll go right back the way it began, and I'm left with three hotel room key cards. Now, a lot of intention has been played to this one, so maybe I'll show you something, one extra trick with this one. Uh, it's a deck of cards. And I'm going to ask anybody they want to insert the card into the deck in any position that they want to. <coughs> Someone step forward and shove it in any position you want to, like you're sticking it into a hotel room key door. Look, this is exactly where you placed it. I don't want to move it uh, in any way. It's directly there. I want you to see the little logo on the end. It's a little crown. Can you see that? And it has a, in the center of the crown, it has a little heart. There's a little heart in the very center of the crown. The interesting thing about that is where you stopped. All these cards are different. The only two with crowns and hearts would be those two. It's like a trick. <laughs>